Hi guys, it's me again, Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. I am coming at you live. This is Dan. Hey y'all. And we are at RA Coffee Raw Company. Raw Coffee Company. Raw Coffee Company. And it is in Goose Creek, South Carolina. So all of you locals out there, brace yourselves. We got some fantastic stuff coming on here. We heard that they had keto. So of course y'all know that I like to come on and see what all is keto. I hope this is not just sharing with me. Oh, there we go, there we go. <laughs> all right, so Katie and I, Katie, have ordered some coffee. <laughs> hey, Angela. Coffee. <laughs> All right. So, the sugar-free flavors are vanilla, caramel, hazelnut, praline, toasted marshmallow, English toffee, Irish cream, gingerbread, peppermint, pumpkin, coconut, raspberry, cherry, mocha sauce. Hey, Loretta. Hey, Christopher. Hey, Marla. All right. So, smells really good. I got the English toffee. And it has heavy whipping cream in it, so you can kind of build your own bulletproof here. If you want butter in it, you can get that. No, I don't like the butter, but that's okay. <laughs> and you can also get coconut oil. You can get Da Vinci. All those flavors are the sugar-free Da Vinci, zero carbs. They also have liquid stevia. Y'all know I love the liquid stevia, so I might even add some of this. I like it super sweet. And we were, mm -hmm. we always um, are looking for new flavors, and we change yes. it up all the time, too. We keep a lot of variety, and we like mixing it up so folks don't get tired of one thing. Perfect cup of coffee. So he's going to tell you about his particular cup of coffee. Lindy, we are in Goose Creek. So for those of you who are local, it's in between Sherman Williams and KFC. Y'all stay away from KFC. Come to Raw Coffee. <laughs> um, so, yes, this is amazing. And so if you're heading to Charleston, it's going to be on your right-hand side, right after the Taco Bell areas and all of that super, super low-key very relaxed environment, got a little radio playing in the background, super friendly, locally owned and operated. Hey Loretta, this is my, one of our local companies in Goose Creek, South Carolina, um, coffee and sweet pastry shop, and we are here to drink coffee and taste the sweets, guys. So tell us about your coffee, Dan. Sure, so um, we started Raw Coffee, it's about, been about six months now. Awesome. Um, we have a five bean blend, it's espresso based, um, out of Oregon is, um, is where our master roaster does our beans. Um, so basically we have two primary types of keto style coffees. We do our version of a Bulletproof, which is with raw coffee, it's coconut oil, we have um, unsalted, the unsalted butter, we can do it unsweetened, uh, it has heavy cream, and then it's hot blended. We can do it um, with a sweetener, like a, a liquid stevia, mm -hmm. or we can use any of the flavors that we had talked about, yes. depending what someone wants, or no flavor at all. We also do um, heavy cream lattes, which yeah. are really popular, um, and we can add any of those flavors with that awesome. too. So she did yes. the little, whatever that's called. Yeah, steam in the milk. Yeah, she yes. steamed <laughs> the milk. See y'all, I'm very not right, I don't know, but you know, now we're here to know, so we all know. Hey Janet, hey Renee, y'all please share this out, especially if you're local, share, share, share this to everywhere local that you possibly can, because we want to get the word out. Y'all know it's hard to find good keto places. Hey Patricia. So I know a lot of you are at work and things like that. For those who aren't, please tag a friend, share. The coffee's amazing. Like, I'm that sorry. That's so great to hear. It That's is. Great. It's, yeah. it's better than Starbucks. So I love the flavor. It's not too strong. It's not like overpowering. It smells very, very good. Shared. Thank you, Lindy. It's, it smells amazing. It tastes amazing. It's just the right amount of sweetener, just the right amount of heavy whipping cream. And you can adjust it if you want. Like, I was all set to put some liquid stevia in here, but I didn't need to because it's absolutely sweet enough. So, we got a couple treats that we're going to try. Um, this is a coconut macaroon, macaroon. Yep, that's our keto coconut macaroon. How many carbs are in this? Carbs on that one. Oh, I need my glasses for that. Yo, I can't wait. So, um, our carbs on that is one gram. Okay, one gram. Okay, so I'm going to have this whole thing for one net gram of carbs. That's amazing. So, let's see. <laughs> Very good. It's really soft. I immediately have that coconut um, crunch, so it's fresh. These are made fresh every day. Mm -hmm. right? mm. yep. Hey, Kelly. Hey, hey, Carolyn. Hey, Loretta. Very cloudy. Fluffy. Fluffy. Yeah. I wish I lived yep. closer. Me too, Loretta. Lindy, you're going to have to come here. I know. It is. These are super, super good. They're very light, very fluffy. Excellent, excellent. Katie likes them too. They go really well. Very light. Very light. Very, very fluffy and light. They go really well with the English topping. Not eggy. Not eggy at all. Super, super great. So I know a lot of us worry about, hey Monica, about the egg flavor when it comes to stuff. We also have a no vet, what, this is, what was so, it? So that is our cheesecake fat bomb. And it, it basically is um, 
hand rolled in a unsweetened uh, chocolate just to give it a little bit of additional flavor. And uh, yeah, awesome. those are really popular. That's one of the newer items we've been doing. All right, so we're gonna try this one out. I know that one's gonna be my favorite. Right, I know this too. <laughs> so I just wanna cut it in half so you guys can see kind of what consistency we have going on here. Looks super Ooh, good. Nice. This is, it's nice and thick. <laughs> Y'all, that is like, I got some peanut butter. That is, that is the bomb bomb. It's, I got some peanut butter, chocolate, cream cheese, just the right sweetness. Super, super good. Yes, Linda, you've got to get here. Hey, Darcy, tell all your friends, hey, Marvy, I need that in my life. Right, Carolyn? They don't ship yet, but that might be something they expand to later. They've been in business six months? Six months now. Six months. So let's support our local businesses. Hey, Sylvie, that is... That's it, I'm moving back, she said. That's it. <laughs> Come on, Brenda, we'll have you. So that's super good. Katie, you wanna taste that one? Oh, and by the way, Ava's over here digging in. She loves, she's a keto baby anyway, but she loves it. So this is super good. Y'all, fat bombs, you normally have to take the time, make them yourself. This is in Goose Creek, South Carolina, Loretta. Yeah, right? Super amazing. Okay, so the next one, and he was super generous with us, y'all. So, just so y'all know, Y'all probably ain't getting a big slice like this, but <laughs> it still is a good slice, y'all know. So this, I'm gonna kind of hold it for y'all to see. This is coconut cake, guys. I need this in Fresno, California. <laughs> we're not there yet. This is locally owned and operated. So we're gonna see what the coconut cake is. Looks very moist. Hmm. Mom, I'm bringing you some of this home. You're going to love it. Wow, that is good. So, y'all know how sometimes the keto desserts are kind of dry and crumbly and, you know, maybe eggy. This is perfect. It's not dry. It's just the right amount of moisture. It's not gummy or caked together. Hey, Megan. Hey, Patricia. Um, it is perfect. The coconut on top is unsweetened coconut, correct? It's unsweetened coconut. And yeah. how many carbs are in this? That one has, I'm sure, mm -hmm. so this one, I, I want to verify, but it's showing net, net carbs of one, one gram. One. Okay, so I'm sure it's a much smaller piece for the net grams of one, but we got to verify that. Yep. And how many grams were the fat bombs? <laughs> the fat bombs were one gram. One gram. Okay, so um, of course, I totally can have ordered that for this girl's party. Look, <laughs> for the girl's party, looks amazing. It really, really is. Hey, Brenda. So if you have not heard yet, please share this out, especially if you're local to the Goose Creek, South Carolina area, Tri-County, Charleston. We want to get the word out on this. It is very rare to find an amazing keto company, keto baking company. They do pastries. They do different things. So I'm going to let Dan tell you about all the different types of stuff that they make that's keto. Yeah. So um, we do mix up our keto every so often. Um, we like keeping variety. We do no-bake um, cookies, which is one of our primary ones. Um, we do a peanut butter uh, coconut uh, no-bake cookie. We also do a, an almond butter um, coconut cookie as well. Um, we've done a chocolate one as well. So it just depends on the day and where it's at. Um, we're very fortunate we have a pastry chef um, in-house here. Um, we, we do a lot of keto, you know, obviously the keto items um, that we've seen a very um, high demand for that. And we like listening to our customers if there's a recipe they would like us to try. Sometimes they work out great, sometimes they don't quite work out so well. Right. But, but we are willing to do that too. Um, we do bake off, um, but we are a regular baker too here for what, what we have. Um, right. Primarily we- So it's good for a family to go coffee. to that yes. has keto and non-keto so everybody can come and enjoy something. In-laws are in Sumter. How close are you? We're visiting. We visit at times. Okay, so from Sumter, I think it's what, Katie, an hour from Sumter? Um, an hour and a half, I think. No. A hour, probably, hour and a half. Something, something like that. Hour. Definitely worth the drive, Renee. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Hey, Vicki. Hey, Jessica. So tell me what else. You said you had a salad as well? Yeah, so we do a keto salad as well, um, and we serve that any time of the day. Um, but basically, we have a um, homemade chicken salad that my wife does, and then it's a Cajun style. She makes a homemade pomeno cheese spread as well that yeah. is that is with that, and then we have an egg salad. So it's it's those three items, and it's put on a uh, small bed of lettuce, awesome. and um, we get a lot of folks coming in for that too. And then of course we have our two primary styles of coffee right now here too. Yes. Yay! So y'all get to this place definitely. Yes, Renee, this is definitely. Hey, Diane. 
And y'all share this with all of your local people, especially. We want to get the word out on keto. He started out with someone, a friend of church. Hey, Ruby. Hey, Tiffany. <laughs> I didn't hit the do not call button. Uh, I had a friend at church that did keto and said, you know, Dan, you really got to get in on this and, and we don't have anywhere to go and get it. So he catered to the local keto people. And so let's blow them up, guys. Let's show up and show them some love out here. Show them how much we love it. Thanks for sharing, Loretta. And maybe if you're visiting, sometimes you guys come through Charleston visiting. Do not miss this little treasure. It is wonderful. <laughs> Um, they do have different things at the time, so you can go ahead. I have um, attached them to this, so you can message them. They're super fast at responding to messages. Hey, Lydia, I asked them last minute about coming by, and they're like, sure, come on in. There's no way we're going to eat all this. We're going to take some home, obviously. It is super great, and the fat bombs are so satisfying. That's one of the one big things that I say. If you're, you're finding yourself getting hungry or you want a snack or something like that, it, it will satisfy you. It's a definite uh, two thumbs up on that. Anything else? Awesome. No, I just want to thank you for the local support. It's been fantastic. Yes. My wife and I started this. It was her 20-year dream to start a coffee shop. And so we're not affiliated with any chain or franchise. We are truly local um, uh, here in Goose Creek. And we'd love to see you. And uh, we're open 5 a.m. to 8 p.m. Monday through Friday. Saturday, 6 a.m. to 7.30 p.m. On uh, uh, Saturdays, of course, Sunday we close for the Lord's Day and a little bit of break. So Wonderful, wonderful. Yeah. I think everybody That's needs us. that. That's us. We'd love to see you, though. And they do have the longer, the later hours. I know a lot of pastry places, you know, they generally close a little bit earlier in the day. But they, and then say we have someone that wants a dozen or two or a whole cake or something like that. Do you do that? Oh, yes. A real simple deal. Um, you could instant message us on, on Facebook. Um, that's probably one of the easiest ways. You can call as well. Um, as I mentioned, we have a pastry chef in house. So, you know, with a little bit of notice, we have most of these items. We do sell out sometimes throughout the day, but, but typically we try to replenish um, for the things that we have, along with our other cinnamon rolls and for the other folks too. Right, cinnamon right. rolls and scones <laughs> and all that we have too. But um, we can do special orders. Um, you know, if you can give us 24 to 48 hours notice, it's great. You can call us. We gladly take the order. Um, like, for example, that carrot cake, I think that may, or not the carrot cake, the uh, coconut cake, it makes 16 slices. We could do full pans of it if that's what somebody wants. Right. So, right. a lot of things we can do for you. So, yeah, so when you guys um, look into, hey Lydia, when you guys look to have a party or something like that, look for little places of treasures like this. And we want to really share this out, share this out to every group because the awareness really needs to be raised on this kind of stuff. I hope y'all have a wonderful day. Thank you so much. Thank you. Dad. Bye, y'all. Thanks so much. Bye. Bye.